Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to um, give to you a tutorial. So let's learn about Tavis, the eight part of speech. So what are those eight part of speech? The noun, pronoun, verb, adjective, adverb, preposition, conjunction, and interjection. So now let's talk first about what is noun. What is noun? So nouns are words that are used to name people, places, animals, ideas, and things. The nouns are classified into two main categories, um, the common nouns and proper nouns. So the common nouns are generic, so they are the general term like ball, car, sticker, hospital, school. And the proper nouns are more specific like Charles, the White House, the Sun, um, the school, which is St. Luke Medical Center, and um, the hospital and the school is St. Louis School. So, here is the example of a noun that is used in the sentence. She bought a pair of sandals. So, sandals here is uh, a noun that refers to a thing. Second, I have a pet. So, um, the noun here is a uh, pet. It refers to animal. Is this your pencil? This refers to an object or thing. So many people have fear of heights. So the fear of heights here emphasizes two ideas or abstract nouns. He is my father. So the father here is a person. And this is my home. So home here is a place, referring to a place. Next is pronouns. What is pronoun? So pronouns are words that are used to substitute in a noun in a sentence. So there are different types of pronouns. Some of them are reflexive pronoun, possessive pronouns, relative pronouns, and indefinite pronouns. So examples of pronouns are the following. I, he, she, it, them, his, yours, anyone, and nobody. So I referring to uh, oneself. So this here refers to a boy. She refers to a girl. It refers to a thing. Then them refers to, uh, this is possessive pronoun, refers to uh, uh, like they. So his or boy, possessive pronoun for he and yours. Anyone is, and nobody is the indefinite pronoun. So examples of pronouns used in the sentence is You reach home at 7 in the morning. So I here is the first person singular, first singular pronoun. Person, yes. Did someone see a blue bag on the counter? So someone here refers to uh, an indefinite pronoun. Is this the girl who won the first prize? So who, who here is? Um, the relative pronoun referring to a girl. That is uh, my mom. So my here is uh, refers to a uh, possessive pronoun. I hurt myself I, yesterday when we were playing football. So uh, myself is the reflexive pronoun for I. Next. Verbs. Verbs are used to denote an action that is being performed by a noun or the subject in the sentence. So they are the action uh, words. Some examples of verbs, read, sit, run, jump, eat, sing, and dance. So example of verbs used in the sentence. She plays chess every day. So place here is our verb. Um, this is a, a singular form of verb since uh, there is only one um, subject. So the second is Jock and Chill are going to the movies. So are here is our verb are going, which is plural because we have two subjects here. My friends visited me last week. So visited here is our verb and it is in the in the past tense, past form of the verb, because it happened already from this 
last week. Did he have your lunch? So, um, have here is our verb. And it, yes, did you have your lunch? And this is this form is um interrogative. My name is Beth. So, um, this is the verb is. Uh, is is the um B form of the verb. Um, the B form of the verb are uh the following. Um, is are like um was where, and uh, yes, that one. Next is adverbs. So what are adverbs? Adverbs are words that used to modify verbs, adjectives, and other adverbs used in the sentence. So there are uh, five main types of adverbs, namely the adverbs of manner, the adverbs of decree, the adverbs of frequency, and the adverbs of time, and the adverbs of place. So examples of adverbs that is used in the sentence. Did you come home here to buy a food? So here, here. Here is the adverb of place. He did not go to school yesterday as she was sick. So yesterday here is the adverb of time. Jean studied her lesson every day. So frequency. Uh, every day here is the adverb of frequency. Can you please come quickly? So quickly here is the example of the uh, adverb of manner. Ben was so sleepy <clears throat> that he could hardly keep his eyes during the meeting so was so also sleepy here is the adverb of decree next um the adjective what are adjectives so they are words that are used to describe about the noun or the subject in a sentence so the adjectives are used to modify a noun or another subject in a sentence so some examples of adjectives include good ugly quick beautiful and bleed so anything that modifies a noun it is called adjective so examples of adjective used in the sentence are the following the place we visited yesterday was noisy so noisy here is an adjective uh, that uh, modifies to the noun which is a uh, place did you see how big that dog was? So how big? Big here is the adjective referring to a dog. The weather is unpleasant today. So unpleasant here is the adjective that describes the noun, which is the weather. The black dress you wore on your birthday was elegant. So elegant here is the adjective that uh, describes the noun, which is the, um, the dress. Yes. Black. Black also is here is uh, the adjective. My sister had only one cake for his birthday. So one one here is um the adjective uh that uh, describes a a cake. Next, prepositions. So prepositions are words that are used to link part of the sentence to another. Prepositions show the position of the object or the subject in a sentence. Some examples of prepositions are in, out, besides, in front of, below, opposite, and etc. So there are examples of this prepositions used in the sentences. The girl walks across the street. So across here is the preposition that link um to um to this the girl walks across the street um second the child hid his birthday presents under his bed so um the preposition here is under next mom asked me to go to the shore near our house so the preposition here is um near and two yes um i pick up my pen below the table so the preposition used here in the sentence is